Last time on Sonic X, Eggman contacted Sonic and the gang with the news that the Metarax were on the move toward Galactic Coordinate 000, where something majorly mysterious was about to happen. The team launched a counterattack, but the mighty Metarex proved themselves indestructible. In the meantime, Shadow and the Chaotix crew crashed the Metarex mothership in the hopes of destroying Dark Oak and his creepy cohorts, while Chris went on a mission to free Eggman. But little did our friends know of the extraordinary occurrence that was about to take place. A catastrophic collision of space and time not seen for a thousand years. It was time for the final transformation. A strange and momentous event that would alter the galaxy forever. Would Sonic save the day or get lost in a watery wasteland never to return? Stay tuned. to be okay. This amulet is a very special one. It belonged to my mother long ago. Sometimes it shows me things others cannot see. He'll be all right. Really? Well, sure. That guy can survive anything. And if Sonic can survive, then we can too. Isn't that right, Cosmo? continues, my genius will no longer flourish. What a terrible loss for evil science. How could they be so selfish? Come on, everybody, let's grab some really big gardening shears and show who's boss. Cosmo, do not fear. I am always with you. Through this amulet, I am watching and guiding you to your destiny. Our planet may have been destroyed long ago, but through you, my daughter, the spirit of our people will live on. Look for the light at the end of the darkness. It is there, in your heart. What are we all standing around for? Shouldn't we be out there fighting? That thing's a hundred feet tall. What do you suggest, champ? Well, we have to do something. There's got to be some way we can break them. Something we haven't thought of. You got your secret weapon right here. Sure, I may be small, but I'm wired. Put a cork in it, Charmy. Finding a weak spot in that gargantuan green meanie out there isn't going to be easy. With the combined power of the Chaos Emeralds, not to mention the Planet X, that three-headed dino boy is a mighty powerful monster. What about the Master Emerald? 
Hey, why didn't we think of that before? If we charge up the Master Emerald enough, we might be able to cause some kind of chaos reaction. Well, it's worth a try. This just might be the idea we're looking for. I gotta hand it to you, Knuckles. Let's get to work on this right away. Thank you, Knuckles. <laughs> ah, it was no big deal. Not so fast, my little space kitties. What if Knuckles' brilliant idea lays an egg? Pardon the pun. What do you mean? We are going up against a whole lot of concentrated energy. Scientifically speaking, even if we charge the Master Emerald to its maximum capacity, it still might not work. So what then? Guess you'll find out soon enough, Tiger. <gasps> I say Knuckles' idea has to work, because it's our only hope for getting Sonic back. And don't forget, you got the team at Chaotix Detective Agency on your side. Yeah, in case the whole thing goes bust. Hey, wait a minute. What if it does go bust? What if the Master Emerald needs more energy than we've got? I have an idea. You can use the Egg Crimson as backup, just in case you need a little more, shall we say, juice. <laughs> Good idea, Eggy. You know, this is almost heartwarming. Everybody working together like this. Don't get carried away. <laughs> Your time is up, my friends. <laughs> When Planet Greengate first came to be, they believed in peace and harmony. Why did it all have to come to this, Tails? Why? Okay, you guys, the power cannon is all set up and ready to go. We've hooked it up to the Egg Crimson for backup. Glad we could be of assistance, kid. But, uh, there may be one slight problem. How is it that you found yourself in this dimension, Chris? Well, I... I used the Master Emerald's energy as a connector to synchronize my world with this one, and then I teleported. Sure you did. You used the Master Emerald as a connector, all right, but when you teleported, you lost six years because of an interdimensional warp string. Hence that inconvenient, not to mention embarrassing shift from strapping young man back to annoying squirt. Those lost years were stored as particle data inside the Master Emerald Energy Centers for safekeeping. Isn't it just astonishing how the Doctor knows absolutely everything? He is a genius with a capital G. So you're really 18, huh? Too bad you're a total shrimpy whip. Who are you calling shrimp? I'm not done! The bad news is that if we use up a large portion of the Master Emerald's energy, you just may be stuck here, Junior. Your particle data may dissipate within moments of charging. In turn, I'm afraid it could take years to renew its current structure. Which means you may never be able to return to your world. And even if you do, your molecular structure could possibly be permanently damaged. Oh, no. Power Cannon, back up to Egg Crimson, and connect. If it means saving my friends from danger, 
I'm willing to take the chance. You're really going through with this, aren't you? I just have to believe I'll see my folks again one day, and when I do, I want them to be proud of me. I have to admit, you are not so bad after all, kid. <laughs> yeah, here I thought you were just a sniffling little brat, but you are not sniffling at all. Sure he ain't. You know, deep down, I always knew you were an okay kid, but these two bozos wouldn't believe me. Who are you calling bozo? Hey, thanks a lot, you guys. I don't know what to say. I'm not gonna let the Metarex win this. You're pretty tough, kid. All right, Tails, it looks like the backup with Egg Crimson has been completed. I've reprogrammed the power cannon so it'll receive a sustained charge from all sources. We're ready. The seven Chaos Emeralds are the servers. Chaos is the power enriched by the heart. Chaos is the power enriched by the heart! for the hunk of junk. that will be all life still and silent, green and glorious. Destruction? 
You wouldn't know about that, would you? And you, Hedgehog, you are the same as all beasts and humans. One can coexist with nature, so you all must be destroyed. Think so? You run in vain, Hedgehog. There is no hope left for you. Why don't you give up? Sorry to disappoint you. See, I got friends waiting for me. Friends, Hedgehog? They have forgotten you. But that, that is the way of such fickle creatures. Go ahead. Keep running, Sonic the Hedgehog. Soon your freedom to run wild and free will be gone. Soon you will be still and silent forever. Do your best, buddy. Kids, it looks like your Master Emerald Master Plan worked like a charm. Oh, wow! Well. <gasps>
Yeah.